There are usually two types of damages to consider in a personal injury claim, and they are special damages and general damages. Special damages are damages that have an actual dollar amount associated with them, such as medical bills, out-of-pocket expenses, and lost wages. These damages are fairly easy to calculate and prove. On the other hand, general damages don't have an actual dollar amount associated with them. Pain and suffering is a type of general damage. Pain and suffering is used to compensate an injury victim for the physical and emotional stress associated with an accident, such as anxiety, depression, or the inability to enjoy day-to-day -day activities. Therefore, pain and suffering can be difficult to calculate. The factors to consider when determining a reasonable amount for pain and suffering include the severity of the actual accident and whether the physical and emotional damages from the injury are permanent. For instance, if someone broke their leg in an accident, their pain and suffering would be much greater than someone who simply suffered a few cuts or scrapes in an accident. If you have questions about how to calculate pain and suffering for a Georgia injury claim, please give us a call. I'm LaShonda Council Rogers with The Council Firm. We are dedicated to helping you achieve the best outcome possible at trial or through settlement. For a free confidential consultation or case review, contact us because our firm cares.